hi everyone welcome to my youtube channel if today is your first time of watching this video don't forget to subscribe turn on the notification bell so that whenever you upload a new video of this nature you get notified and to all my subscribers i love you guys i say may god bless may god grant you all your heart desires in all you do now in today's video i want to share with you a very strong powerful spiritual recipe or a very strong powerful advice that these are some of the mistakes that most of us have been making and i want to use this medium to correct us from not thinking in that angle or to correct us from not behaving or acting in that angle these are the two negative sentences that might stop you from attracting what you want in life these are the two negative sentences that might prevent you from attaining that height you want in life and i want you there are many of them but i'm going to be sharing with you just two sentences and i want you to take note of this and i want you to make amend of this and i want you to have it as a mindset of trying to be positive and trying to accept everything that comes to your life as in the positive side of whatever that happens to your life and these two negative words that i want to share with you which i don't want you to be doing that is if you will know that you are doing this or if you know that you are have to find out trying to believe that this doesn't work for you i want you to change that motive now the first negative word is this it will not work for me i may not get it right or i am not that person the what makes you think that it will not work for you when you are saying it does not work for you automatically you have disqualified yourself from that and working for you or maybe you are going for an interview and somebody is telling you now it does interview will not work for me because i don't have anybody there you are going for a job you said no nobody will take me there because i don't have anybody there to help me you have automatically disqualified yourself even before attempting it i want you to change that motive and always believe that wherever you go that your luck will shine stop believing no it will not work for me because i don't have anybody there stop believing it will not work for me because i'm a novice stop believing it will not work for me because i don't know anybody or nothing of that nature has ever worked in my family don't believe it believe you me if nobody in your family has ever driven car you might be the necessary person or the first person to drive that car always believe that good things will work for you that those that cannot work for you is just the bad ones change that your narrative that it will not work for me change that your narrative that i am not capable change that your narrative that i cannot do this or change that your narrative that maybe i'm too weak to do this change that narrative that of fear that no something is going to prevent me or something is fighting against me change that narrative and believe you me you'll be happy then the second word which is the most dangerous of it all is that i am not able no stop that word i am not able or i may not be able or you are able you are strong you are powerful you are great you are unstoppable you are nothing but strong beyond your own expectations you are able to achieve or actualize anything you so much desire in love stop believing you're not able stop believing you are too weak stop believing that you cannot make it what makes you think you're not able but have you calculated yourself you think god doesn't know about you god knows exactly about you god knows what you're up to god knows your destiny god knows what you can be tomorrow what you can now don't disqualify yourself by saying i am not able those who are there what makes you think they are better than you you are created by god the same god who created them you are able stop saying i am not able to do this i wasn't able to do this you are able stop neglecting who you are and acknowledge yourself as the strong personality that god has made you to be and believe me you're going to be more stronger than you beyond your expectations i am not able i am not able i have prayed i have prayed i am not able to do this you are able you are strong you are powerful you are able to overcome or to conquer anything you so much desire in this life all you have to do is cultivate the mindset of positivity cultivate the mindset of of forwardness cultivate the mindset of power cultivate the mindset of speciality what i mean by speciality is when you believe that even when our god has go there and fail if i go there i will succeed believe you me like i always tell you what you think is what you attract if you think you are going to make it believe you me you automatically attract the force from where you never thought they're going to be believe you me if you can change this your mindset that i am able i will do is if you have any situation in your life always look at the positive side of every situation you find yourself don't always look at the negative side of the situation you find yourself always look at the positive side if things is not actually working exactly the way you want it don't take negative or things always attach positive sentiments to it and believe in me you will conquer it within a twinkle of eye even before you know it always ask and receive by believing that you have received it and believe you me things will start working for you things will start manifesting itself very very well for you don't believe you cannot do it you can do it better than those who you are trying to emulate 
Don't believe you cannot get there. You can get there even faster than those who are trying to emulate. Don't believe you cannot make it. You can make it even more well than those who are trying to emulate. Don't believe you are weak. You are even stronger than those who you are looking at them that they are stronger than you. Bring out your personality and believe in me, your personality will surprise you. The God of the universe who made you to this planet will stand by you strong and firm. This is just my only little advice. And to anybody or anyone who it was in any way, I am sorry about this. This is just my only little advice to motivate you, to boost you, to make you know that you are special, to make you know that you are unstoppable, to make you know that yes, you can do it, to make you know that any situation that comes to you has a very strong, permanent, positive impact in your life. Don't look at the negative impact. Always create that most positive atmosphere and watch how your life will be in a direction of positive wealth, happiness, and success. Thank you all and God bless. This is just my only two kindly advice and I want you to implement one or two things which I've said here and believe you are going to see positive differences in your life. Thank you all and God bless.